This is your UF Virtual Permit Guide. Students, faculty, and staff will no longer have to purchase a physical parking decal and place it on their vehicle. Instead, those who wish to purchase parking permits will be purchasing a virtual permit. So, what are these new virtual permits? Virtual permits use your license plate information to identify your vehicle rather than a traditional physical decal or hang tag permit. Why did UF change to virtual permits? Virtual permits have numerous benefits, including efficiency and sustainability. You will no longer need to wait for a permit to arrive in the mail, and it eliminates a substantial amount of printed material waste that resulted from annual decal sales. Students are allowed to register one vehicle to a parking permit. Faculty and staff can register up to three vehicles to a parking permit. However, only one vehicle can be on campus using the permit at a time. How does permit by license plate work? When a vehicle parks on campus, the rear license plate is captured by cameras mounted on enforcement vehicles. Because the rear license plate on parked vehicles must be captured by cameras mounted on enforcement vehicles, backing into spots will not be allowed if your vehicle only has one license plate on the rear. If your vehicle is registered to a two-plate state and you have a second plate already on your vehicle, you may back into parking spots. When scanned by the cameras mounted on the enforcement vehicles, the numbers of your plate are automatically referenced against the parking database to verify a valid permit and the proper parking privileges for the lot location. Still have questions? Visit taps.ufl.edu or email parking at ufl.edu.